Hey y'all, what's up everyone? How y'all doing? I'm every bit of amazing. You know, um, right now, just sitting here in the house and answering messages and um, talking to a lot of good people. Well, everybody's good people um, in their own magical way. But, you know, I... I'm, I often look at life a lot of the times of just love. You know, I want to love everything, and I want to love you, and I want to love me. Um, and I know oftentimes it gets really hard, especially when you have people that want to drag you down and make you feel bad about the person that you are or that you've turned into or um, or even who you want to be you know um, I'm not I don't blame anyone because I have nothing but love in my heart because especially for the ones that don't like me and I'm blessed every single day that I have those people because if I didn't get to feel hurt then I wouldn't know what it's like to feel good and you know the way I look at life is even you know okay for instance this house I'm in right now it to most people it's just a house to me it took a crew of multiple people to build it took people who had families or who have families who probably got injured, you know, hitting a nail or, you know, they could have whatever. You know, they have passions, they have life, and they have love inside of them because if they didn't, then they wouldn't be building these homes. But it took those people. And so what is it exactly that these people were going through at this time? How is it that someone could have possibly impacted them to actually say, you know what, I'm going to get up today and I'm going to go to work and I'm going to do my job to the best of my abilities so that way when the people that live in this home have somewhere to come safely to every single night. And then I've got to work to feed my family. I have got to work to pay the doctor bills, to pay insurance. You know, it's it's taken people, blood, sweat, and tears, and even down to the cobblestones in Boston, Massachusetts. The people that took time to lay the stones, if those things could actually talk, what stories would they tell? And if this house could talk, what stories would it tell? Life is beautiful. You just got to see beyond the fear. And you've got to see beyond the pain. Open your eyes. Love y'all. Peace.